is National Pina Colada Day, so I want to give you all the ingredients for a wonderful riff on a pina colada. So the ingredients for a Hey Mambo are coming up next. Today we're going to use three quarters of an ounce of Luxardo Maraschino liqueur, a quarter ounce of Aperol, a half an ounce of Mezcal, a half an ounce of tequila, Blanco, one and a half ounces of pineapple juice, one and a half ounces of coconut cream, a half an ounce of lime juice. We'll make this in a Nutribullet or a blender. I know that's a lot of ingredients, but stick around. It's gonna really pay off. All right, you can make this in a blender, but I'm gonna make it in my Nutribullet because that's what I have. Um, so I found this recipe on imbibe.com. It is by Mark Hubbard at Via Vicha in Portland, Maine. I checked and as far as I know, they're still open. Uh, I couldn't get my hands on Luxardo Apertivo, which the original recipe called for. So I subbed out Aperol and then did the Luxardo Maraschino. You can bring those two ingredients to equal levels if you like, but if you think of another sub, I'd love to hear about it in the comments. So let's just add three quarters of an ounce of the Maraschino liqueur to the cup. Then um, I'm going to do a quarter ounce of Aperol. And then we're going to have a half an ounce of Mezcal. I'm using Oaxaca today. And then um, an ounce and a half of pineapple juice. Then we're going to have an ounce and a half of coconut cream. And then um, a half an ounce of lime juice. Ooh. So next I'm going to uh, put six ice cubes in my little Nutribullet here. But what I did was I used my Lewis bag and crushed that up because I find that if I put like a whole ice cube in this thing, it just cracks the cup. So I crushed it a little bit beforehand. So I am going to go blend this. I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. Let's get this into our tiki glass. You can either use a tiki mug or a highball glass. I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna fill this three quarters of the way with crushed ice and then let's get this in there. Okay. That looks pretty good actually. And then let's get a couple pineapple fronds in there. See how that looks. You could top this off with a little bit of crushed ice, but I think it looks really nice with the froth on there. So that is the Hey Mambo. All right, let's try the Hey Mambo. Oh yeah. I enjoy a good, smooth, creamy cocktail and this one hits the spot. It's herbal. It's bright, it's smoky, it's sweet from the Luxardo, and the Aperol does curb that cherry flavor a lot, and it makes it a lot more subtle. Uh, it goes down really easy. It's refreshing. It's a new approach to a pina colada. I think we could all still call it a pina colada, but it's tropical anyway. It's a fun change, and that's really nice. So that's it for this week, everybody. Next week, I'm gonna make a cocktail with rum and Prosecco. So happy Pina Colada Day, and we will see you next week. Be well.